Hello everyone, welcome back to Positron Plays Darkest Dungeon. So I want to try our four vessel setup again. Um, Alright, we have a couple of short champion missions available, so I think it's a good time to try it out. Orange is probably best bet, has more undead enemies I think. Well, maybe not, it has mostly pigs, huh? This is going to be a lot of blight and heavy hitters. Yeah, we'll probably try the Warrens. Uh, Goulash was one of our frontliners, and I think so was Kate. And then Amy will be in the third row. Or, uh, Roras will be in the third row, Amy will be in the back. I'm not sure which is a better setup. Maybe we have, uh, Roras in the back, Amy third row. Uh, Goulash needs a different set of skills again. We need, uh, Judgment, Mace Bash. Um... Probably Illumination Hand of Light. Is Kate actually a little tankier? No, she's not. Let's do that. And... I think this is the correct setup. Again, I have uh, Judgment just in case she gets swapped around. And I don't think I have any good trinkets that I'm, I'm not already using here. Alright, so let's give this another shot. Kind of interested to see how this works out. I could put, um... Martyr Seals on Aurora's. How low would that make her HP? 17! Give her 30 death blow resist. I think that's just like an unlikely scenario. I think if she's even with 30, you probably wouldn't help, but let's try it out. So this is just a short mission. I'm still gonna bring a lot of food. And a fair amount of torches. Oh, it's the Warrens, might need a couple of shovels. I'll bring one of them each of the rest. Uh, eight torches should be enough to keep us going, I think. Give it a shot, see how it goes. And we can always bail out if we need to, but I, I really do want to try to get one of these missions done, just to, just to see. Play with around with it a little more. It was actually working fairly well Indeed. last time until we get a bad swap. Yeah, Rars is freaking out. She'll be fine. 100% room battle. So if we get scouting, that would be nice. Uh, I think we pile, or we pour holy water on these? Yeah. Okay. We get a disease charm. Eh, it's not really that good. I'm just gonna toss that actually. Alright, we got surprise. Surprises aren't too bad because it's fairly easy to have most of the back row sorted. Yeah, so we'll just go for for damage here. Wow, Rarsh got crit. That's unfortunate. She's in a bad place. I really don't want her up there. I will max out our light. Let's see. We can do extra damage to Unholy. Not as much damage as I was hoping, though. Can we switch Kate and... Yeah, okay. Let's, let's get her back in the third row there. She can use a bandage. And... I think healing herself or doing damage would be the same, but let's heal her. Just because she's unlikely to hit. Good, and she's back out of melee range, which is much, much safer. We'll have Amy heal her up. Make sure she's topped off as much as possible. Alright, it's her turn again. Let's go for the attack. Missed. I mean, that's unfortunate. Her accuracy is very, very low. Should be able to get a kill pretty much... No matter what. Yeah, there we go. There's even a crit. That's pretty nice. So we get some some of that stress down. Since Aurora's stress starts off really, really high. Kate's gonna get a little bit of stress, but she's fine. Alright. Do we want to do minus dodge or minus damage? Uh, let's just go for the heavy damage. Mm, I was hoping to get a kill. Not so much. Good dodge from Kate. And Roris' dodge is relatively high. I gave her one of those uh, dodge cloaks. Confidence surges as the enemy crumbles. 
Uh, I don't think there's any reason to go for a heal there. Unfortunately, we didn't get the kill. Three more damage. Mm, might get Mirars do it. Eh, it was worth a shot. But this should get the kill. Nice. That was actually a pretty low chance to hit. We get another key. Alright. Good start. Uh, we would use a bandage on this. We don't have any, though. Yeah. And she resisted. That's why I figured it. You know, she would probably resist, so. Alright, let's max our light out. A lot of these units have buffs from light. So we got a wall coming up. And. Hallway combat. Such blockages are unsurprising. And room combat These in the next area. Even the earliest settlers. And we don't have any camps at all. This is just a short mission, so we can't get any of those buffs or anything. It's not really too many buffs, it's just um just accuracy and dodge, so. Alright, so we can get rid of a, a quirk here. Oh, I wonder if we, we can try and get rid of fragile, actually. And it worked. Nice. Alright, so that's really good. Actually took her out of the sanitarium to be able to do this, so... Um, that definitely works out well. Alright, so we got the same combat again. We didn't get a surprise this time. In either direction, which is good. Bleeding. Uh, might pull Amy to the front of the crit. No. Did stress out Aurorus, though. Uh, everybody is kind of injured, so let's go for the heal. There's no bonus, yeah. So, uh, try to get the militia. Yeah, nice. I gotta say, it's most likely to be able to one shot, so. Burn in the holy flame. Alright. Let's go for an illumination. Ah, oh, it did hit. Alright, so that's a, a minus dodge. Nice. So let's Aurora's hit. Very good combination there. Go for it again. Resistant, but still has it. Might Kate might get pushed back. She did not. And she's pretty resilient. Usually that Ren does more than one damage just to just to start off. I don't think we have taken enough damage to really go for a heal here. So let's just finish this one off. Might be able to get a stun here, actually. Nope, resisted. Let's try for it again. That's probably really unlikely. Yeah. The way is lit. The path but our light is, is back to max now, which we is kind of nice. Only the strength to follow it. Had the potential to be a big hit, but didn't quite make it. And let's just go for the kill. Ooh. Good, okay. I didn't want to stack bleed there. Well, now that we have um, an extra turn here... Get a little bit of healing, and this should be the kill. Nice. All right, good. This expedition at least promises success. All right, so we eat a little food before we go into this room. Room combat tends to be a little more difficult, on average, at least in my experience. All right, what do we got in here? We got a food table. I'm right, get a heaver. This is tough. Not a lot of heavy hitters in here, but um. About to break. Just a lot of, a lot of different units. Alright, so the heroes should be really easy to kill. In fact, Aurora's can probably get the, the killing blow on that. Might be a stun on Amy. Good, she resisted. We want our healer available if possible. I would like to illuminate the witch. Dodged. In Radiance, may we find victory. Maxed our light again, of course. Uh, crit stress is, is rough for for everyone. I would like to. Oh, we can't stun that far back. Let's just try to kill it. Ah, oh, these dodges. All right, come on, Aurora's. Nice. Okay, good, good, good. That's what I was counting on. That was a hell of a gamble, but it paid off. Really need to land a hit on this damn witch. And nobody's accuracy is particularly low here. It's just that the witch has extremely high dodge. The match is 35 base. We did get the debuff though, born. so that'll make them essentially only have five dodge now, which is much better, much easier to hit.
couple of bleeds going out. Not bad. It's manageable damage. Need one more attack for this witch. Um. Yeah, I think we should just go for it. Just to get it out of the way. Before the debuff runs out. Alright, that bleed's stacking up at 6 damage a turn now. It's pretty significant. Let's see if we can get a stun going out here. Nice. Alright, good. Might be a stun on Aurora's. That's not so bad. She's not... Um, she doesn't have a lot of potential right now, so... Try to debuff this pig. Less damage. Resisted. Try it again. Good, okay, good. He is debuffed, so he'll be doing less damage, less chance to hit. Especially good because he was going after Auroras. Uh, I think we need to heal here. That's <laughs> only healed for one. Not the heal I was hoping for. This will give us a nine heal. Let's do it. A little bit of a war of attrition going on here. All right, Pig's got 24 left. Heal up again. Going into round six here pretty soon. There we go, that's what we want, those crits. All right, four damage left on the Pig. Might be an Aurora's kill uh, in the cards. Uh, I wanna just go for melee damage here. I probably should've killed the, yeah, he's gonna get another turn, I think, the Pig that is. Could be a stun on Amy. Not high damage, so it's not so bad. Resisted anyway, so it's not a big deal. Maybe Roros can get the kill here? No. There we go. Alright, so we just have the champion left. Heal up though. I think it'd be pretty easy for us to come out ahead on healing, so there we go. Alright, so let's check this table and get some food. I should have brought a, another herb actually. And we will eat up a little bit. Alright, so what do we got left? Uh, max potential of three rooms of combat, basically. Those are the scrolls we already used. Alright, heads to the north. We have a trap coming up. We'll probably have Gulash check that out. Make sure that Aurora doesn't step in it. She's doing okay stress-wise so far. All right, down to our last stack of food. Yeah, I was gonna say pretty unlikely for uh, Curious is the trap Vestal art. to be able to disarm. His I think. Efficacy unwitnessed by his own eyes. We did get scouting, so we only have one combat left throughout this entire dungeon. That's comforting. Hate with the disarm is a torch, and uh, we'll use that here. Oh, we get a damage buff here. That'd be really nice. Oh, I don't have any more herbs, though. Uh, I don't think it's... I think it's too risky to try it. So I'm just going to skip it. Yeah, I definitely should have brought more herbs. That's too bad. All right, we got a pack here. All right, so we're, we're getting a fair decent amount of money. We're not going to get all of our money back, I don't think, but um, enough. The light. The promise of safety. Well, one out of two is not bad, Kate. All right, so our light is pretty much maxed. Let's eat up. Just uh, cap out here. Good, all right, so we're going to this last battle full. We get two flesh eaters, a thunder and a heaver. So there is a chance that Aurora is gonna go over the edge during this combat, but uh, this is not a difficult combat. These are all very low damage enemies. And uh, their dodge is all moderate. If we can prevent people from getting disease, that would be preferable. Very unlikely to stun here, though. Just keep going for the healer. Seven damage, that's a really nice roll on Aurora's. Drums of Doom, okay, so here's where the difficulty comes in. Yeah, she's getting up there. It's only 14, though, that's surprising. I expected that to be a lot more. All right, let's, uh, let's go for the heaver. Missed, unfortunately. 
crit on Amy with the disease there. And very close with Aurorus. Another crit. Wow, that's... All right, she's over the edge. She's now irrational. Eyes are on fire, so beautiful. I must gouge them out. Oh, dear. All right, so we run the risk of her hurting herself now. We really got to land a hit here. There we go. Mother, father, too late. The count has taken me. The beautiful hymn sung by the pigs of St. Martha's. That's kind of interesting. We haven't really seen uh, a vessel go over the edge too much here, so... Kind of interesting to get those uh, those dialogues. Alright, nice crit there. Now reduce his ability to dodge further attacks. So hoping Amy get the cleanup there. Not so much. One more attack will do it, though. And uh, Goulash runs the risk of... Passing over stress here. I'll be no mother superior or otherwise. I do remember that line. Alright, she hurt herself, but she's okay. She just flat out missed there. Good dodges. There is no escape. Alright, she's kind of stressing everyone out. Good. Wow, huge crit. 34 crit from a Vestal. That's massive. Alright, we got one left. Just this Flesh Eater. Crush it with our maces a bit, and we will be done. And we'll have a successful endeavor with our bulletproof Vestal party. Feels pretty good. Remind All right, yourself let's check our loot here. I don't think a key will help us. No. All right. Oh, I feel like uh, Aurorus might have swiped something there. All right, we're done. Nice. So that was successful. That was pretty fun. I like that. You are doing just work, ending them. So we got a bunch of heirlooms, which, you know, we don't really need them. Alright. Uh, hemophilia is kind of bad. Prove balance, resist, resilience is good. Aurora's gets ruins tactician, nice. And she's level 2, so that worked out really well. There is a great horror beneath the manor. Plague Knight is still missing. She really needs to come back, so we need to level her up. That must be destroyed. So well, uh, I don't think Aurora seems to go. She just seems to go chill out somewhere. Hey, why don't you go drink? Uh, Goulash needs to rest. Take her into the, uh, the transept. Kate could go for a rest too. And I'm tempted to send all of our vessels to rest. Oh, who had, um... Oh, it didn't stick. Whoever got the hemophilia didn't stick there. Amy could use to get rid of one of those traits. Uh, Fox still has a ton of stuff he's gonna get rid of. And... Throw Carmilla in there. Alright, let's check the wagon. Let's see, the Dark Tambourine, huh, plus 15% death blow resist. What's Fox using right now? Just uh, bloody dice and deteriorating bracer. You know what? I'm actually going to buy that for him. And uh, just so I don't forget to equip him. Can I swap that out right now, I wonder, while he's still in there? Okay, I can, yeah. So that's pretty good. So you won't have the 10 dodge bonus anymore, but uh, plus 15% death blow resist, I think, at this point is critically important. Especially for our only Jester. Oh, what else was I don't think I really want to buy anything else. Pretty low on cash. Alright, so that went well. Um, thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, click like. Helps out a lot. And subscribe if you want to see more. See you soon.